How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Oblivion. We're here at Castle Coral because we're continuing on with some miscellaneous quests. And this is a pretty fun one. Pretty unique one, in fact. Let's head on in. So I should have high enough fame and personality and everything that I can just walk in and talk to the Countess. You okay over there? Hello. It's a pleasure to meet you. I am Countess Valga of Coral. I wish I had time to chat, but I'm afraid I'm in the middle of an investigation. You don't say. You seem the trusting type. Perhaps you can assist me. It seems someone has taken away an heirloom that is quite dear to me. I want you to help me recover a stolen painting. The painting was of my lost love, the Count Valga, and it has been stolen from my bedchamber. Aww. If you find the painting and bring the culprit to justice, you shall be justly rewarded. What say you? Sounds like a plan. Very well. I suggest you begin to gather clues. And I warn you, do not accuse the wrong person, or I shall be quite cross with you. <laughs> well, we wouldn't want that, would we? Keys. They should allow you access to many of the restricted areas in Castle Coral. Cool. Good luck, investigator. So actually, I guess it would have probably been a good idea to come back here while doing the Thieves' Guild, so I could just run in and steal everything with no repercussions, but eh, whatever. Alright, so we have to start by questioning people to gather some clues, so let's do that. A pleasure to meet you again. Why did he just, like, 360 to... <laughs> whatever. My duties rely on watching no more than the throne and attending to visitors. But confidentially, I will say that Orgnolf has been acting a bit unusual. His abuse of drink has gotten worse lately. He is taken to asking for money from others to purchase spirits. A porter's wage does not befit his habit. Good to know. May the wind be oh, on your back. I was lucky to find you here. I'm Bitneld, the curse bringer, captain of the Coral Guard. What can I do for you? I'm sorry, I wasn't in that evening. I was making my rounds of Coral. The only odd occurrence lately was with Channel. I have seen her spending a lot of time in the West Tower. When I asked her about it, she said it involved her spell research. I suppose at the time it sounded good enough for me. Also, am I crazy? Or shouldn't it be Chanel, not Channel? Alright, let's uh, keep looking around. Ain't stained carpet. Hmm. Alright, let's check around upstairs. Unlock some doors and whatnot. I don't actually remember. It'd be funny if these remained unlocked My pleasure, really. after you completed the quest. I don't know if they do or not. What? Uh, we're in the East Tower. Okay. Remember the clue? He said something about the West Tower. Is there anything super interesting in here? Like, not really, it looks like. So yeah, you could come in here and steal all the stuff, but there's not anything that uh, super useful, it seems. Hey there. Hello. What can I do for you, Sir Knight? Huh. I don't remember seeing Channel or Orgnolf that entire evening. But then again, I stayed in my quarters most of the night. There was no point in going on my usual walk with all of the rain falling. As far as Channel and Orgnolf go, they seem fine to me. I only had a minor scrape with Orgnolf recently. I caught him drinking in the West Tower on the upper level. I told him if he didn't stop, I would tell the Countess. He just grumbled and agreed. He hasn't bothered me since. Okay. So he's got a little bit of a drinking problem. Hello. 
Some nice paintings you got there, Mr. Lath. Hmm. Hello. Now, I already know what the solution is, but we're going to make it as suspenseful as possible, right? Hello. Hi there. Any luck yet? Hello. Are you searching for something? The night that the painting was stolen, I was in the courtyard of the castle taking star readings. Were you? After a while, I decided to go into the dining area just off the Great Hall. I poured myself some wine and studied the charts I had made until it was time to sleep. From there, I went directly to my chamber and slept the rest of the night. Do you notice anything strange about what she said? Ah, now you're stuck in there. Oh, yeah. That would be the uh, Countess's bedchambers. She didn't give me the key to that one, so I guess that the... Uh... Well... I guess the message I was picking up on was not uh, not correct. Let's take a look at the West Tower, though, right? Remember uh, Channel, not Chanel, apparently, was supposedly hanging out in here. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. So somebody likes painting. That just uh, took me <laughs> around to the outside, didn't it? Where the heck am I? What? There we go. <laughs> now I can actually see. Morning. Don't mind me, friends. Uh, was there anybody else left to talk to? Yeah, because I got a green quest marker. Oh yeah, the drunk dude. You. So, you a living statue, or are you gonna say something? The night of the theft, I was in the Great Hall, having an argument with a delivery boy from Braville. It seems his horse lost its footing in the heavy rain we had that night, and the shipment of port that it was carrying slipped to the ground. Oh, the fall broke most of the bottles. He didn't want to claim responsibility, but I gave him what for and sent him away. After that, I spent the rest of the night in my quarters, reading. Yeah, I'm going to go with not reading, because uh, we saw his quarters. <laughs> okay, now I can activate these. Paint stains and a paint footprint. Mm-hmm. So if you haven't figured it out yet, basically, this dude not giving us the uh, true story of what happened. He says he was in his room reading. We know that he was actually in his room drinking. But, uh... For Channel, we have some suspicious painting supplies. She said she was in the dining room, right? And we found paint stains there. Now, let's go back to the West Tower. Maybe I would get a journal entry for that now. I guess you have to talk to everybody first. Yep. All right, we have enough clues. And I think I know who it is. Actually, I know I know who it is. Because <laughs> I've done this one before. Just want to make sure I've unlocked everything. I think I did. 
Um, where are you? You're the Divine Crusader. That I am. I just got to uh, find her to accuse her. <laughs> ah, she must have fled because she knew. There you are. Hello again. All right. Take your time. Let's go ahead and. I wish I. You should... Please, I'm embarrassed. You're. Oh, goodness. That'll what work. Can I say? All right. I know it was you. Are you accusing me of taking the painting? <laughs> no, yes. Very well. I confess to the crime. But please understand, I only did it out of the great love I had in my heart for Count Volga. It was I that painted that portrait. When the Count was lost, the Countess spent so much time with it that I became jealous. I had to have the painting back, so I decided to steal it, then hide it behind the painting in my quarters. Okay. I'm ashamed of my crime. But ready to face what fate has in store for me. So can I just kill her now and say I found the thief? I am undone. She hid it behind her other painting? Yeah, whatever. So I think that if you don't have her disposition up a certain amount, she won't admit to it, but you can still complete the quest. Oh, you have returned from your investigation. Because you have the I'm evidence. Eager to hear the results. Whom did you accuse? It was oh I can't choose or golf or whatever that would have been funny. I'm shocked to hear of Chanel's crime, as she has always been such a nice member of our court. But I see that your evidence is without question. And also she admitted to it. She shall be banished from Castle Coral and stripped of her duties. However, I am not without pity, and therefore she shall not be jailed. But she is never to set foot in Coral again. Congratulations on a job well done. As a reward, please accept this bounty of gold and gems. You've earned it. Golden gem, not golden gems. Farewell. So yep. Yeah. So yeah, that was kind of cool, right? Did I actually just get one gem? Oh no, I got more. <laughs> All right, I want to try something. Let's rest 24 hours and let's see if the doors are still unlocked. You'll notice it did remove the keys from my inventory. It would be funny though if they didn't. Ah, uh... Uh, they. They definitely seem to still be open. Nice. All right, good to know. up cool so yeah that was a pretty cool quest i like these really like weird oblivion quests they're pretty unique um so oh you know what let's go check out um oh i guess we can't because the painting is in her private quarters but the painting does actually make its way back onto the wall which is kind of cool um cool so we got some more time let's go ahead and do another quest um, but I have to figure out which one, so give me a second. Alright, I got another one. So we're here in Leowin, and we're going to the Mage's Guild, actually. Gotta talk to somebody. <laughs> Who was it? Nice to meet you. May all your travels be safe. Strassa of the Mages Guild, Evoker, and but perhaps you're uh -huh. an adventurer? Could you assist me in acquiring something for my crystal collection? Straight to the point, eh? Good, I like that. I'm searching for some specific crystals known as Garadan's Tears. If you can locate these objects for me, I pay handsomely for each one. Wonderful. I had a good feeling about you from the moment that I saw you. 
I want you to bring me as many of Garidan's tears as you can find. If you do, I will pay you a fair bounty in gold for each one. Okay. I confess, I have a weakness for crystals of a magical nature, and I must add these to my collection. This is a personal errand, you must understand, just between you and I. The Mages Guild has nothing to do with it. Okay. Any uh, are not hints on where I can find these? They're literally the frozen tears of a knight named Garadan Staurus, who lived many years ago. I'm not certain what happened to the knight or why the tears were frozen, but I do know someone you could ask. Seek out Juliana Fanis at the Arcane University in the Imperial City. She oversees the Alchemy Headquarters there. If anyone can help you... All right. Bring my salutations to Juliana. Safe journey. So you may know that's not where I need to go. You may know that the Arcane University is actually locked off to people that are not in the Arcane University. However, the quest that we're doing will move this NPC from the locked portion into the lobby here, I believe. So we should be able to talk to said person. What can I help you with? There she is. You aren't the first person to go looking for those. Quite a remarkable story, really. I know a bit about it. Okay. Certainly. Garretton was a knight who lorded over a small village of peaceful farmers. One harvest summer, there was a horrible drought. The farmers appealed to Garretton to discover a solution. He spent a week consulting with sages until one of them mentioned a possibility. The sage told him of an artifact called the Everflow Ewer. The vessel, which looked like a silver pitcher, was said to supply endless water. Sounds useful. <laughs> Amazing. Yes, indeed. Legend has it that Garadan found the Ewer, and that it was guarded by a fearsome creature. It is also said that the creature froze him. When Garadan realized his quest was a failure, and he wouldn't be able to return and save the farmers, he began to shed some tears. Is this before or after he was frozen? Okay, that makes sense. Some of his were frozen as well. Some even say that the divine Mara took pity on the poor knight. To commemorate his kind heart, she imbued the tears with some sort of magical power. That's only rumor, though. You know, if you're really interested in more, there's a book I read once called Nightfall. It may have more about Garadan. I think I saw a copy last time I was at the first edition bookshop in the... All right. Please visit... Little scavenger hunt. Don't think I'm surprising anybody, though, when I let you know that our scavenger hunt is going to turn into a dungeon dive. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. It might be faster to just buy it. You know what? What can I? No. Nope. Good day. Some of these books are actually not out on the uh, shelves, and you have to buy them to get them. It might be out here, though. Whatever, we'll just buy it. What can I interest you with? Forty-eight gold. I can't afford to do that. I don't think I've ever bartered with this guy. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, let's see what it says. 
the mountains near Bruma. Using just the story <laughs> written in the book, I was able to exactly pinpoint the location. That's pretty impressive. Do I have to go talk to her again, or can I just go get the thing? All right, I guess I'll talk to her. How are you today? I'm fine. Anything else? I wish I could tell you more. Yes, I have them for sale. If have a look around, you won't find better prices in all Tamriel. Okay, wait, hold on. What did I miss just now? The book also mentions needing special refined frost salts to get into the glade. Okay. Anything else? Have a look around. Right, I didn't pay attention to that. Prices in all. Tell me more. Right, 100% disposition. I don't actually remember how many I need, so we'll just buy them all. Alright. Yeah, I guess that counts as near Bruma, but we'll start from here. I suppose the whole uh, frost salts thing is to keep you from getting in here earlier than you're intended. Never been too big a fan of that mechanic, but uh, it's certainly better than the... Uh, oh, you need a key. We got some dogs running around in here. Somebody having a... Oh, 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 no. What in the world is going on here? Okay, well, I definitely didn't expect uh, this. Kind of weird. Uh, let's not get distracted, though. More distracted, anyway. You know, it's weird. Since I was added to the animal faction by completing, um... Shadows in the Struggle of Power or whatever. Some animals still attack me and some don't. And I'm not exactly sure what the criteria is. What the criteria are. Alright, in we go. See? He's friendly. He's got those crazy eyes, though. Yeah, they're all friendly. <laughs> you see, the music keeps changing because the game is like, oh, enemies. Okay. All I must do is touch the thing while holding on to the salts. All right, cool. So as with uh, this one, right? No. Yeah, this one. We're actually in a unique area now, which is kind of cool. Ouch. Uh, y wait, where is he? Is that him? <laughs>
Wait, wait, I just want to see him. Oh yeah, that is... There we go, now you can see it. Neat. Okay, they weren't kidding about the frost burns as if it were fire. Jeez. Um... Killed you. Can I activate this in some way? Ah. So I guess they are just scattered around the area. I actually don't remember this quest that, uh, that well. I suppose it's likely that they're all going to be scattered around this general area. You know what, I got so many health potions. Kinda hard to see. There we go, there's one. That's very hard to see. <laughs> How do I just know uh, there should be more? Oh, see, I thought that was one. here This isn't really helping, is it? <laughs> what the heck? Found it. What a spot. And you know what else I totally forgot is if you go back to uh, what's his face the Khajiit, he'll actually give you you know fast travel while taking health damage. I guess that makes sense. He'll actually give you some uh, potions to become immune to that. So yeah, I could have done that. I guess. Oh well. Oh, well. Back we go. Oh, okay. I guess we have to exit. And as far as I know, there's nothing else in here. It's just those, so... That's fine. Hi, doggy. Good thing they're totally cool with me just hanging out inside their little cave. Okay, so now we can go back. Yep. And get our reward. Pleasant. This is good uh, painting stealing weather, I think.
That's what we call a callback. Uh, yeah, here it is. Still hanging out in the same spot? Any new books you've been reading? Eh, I got more important business. You look like you've seen some travel. Wait, can I still get the potions? Yes, I've refined frost some. No, I can't. You found five of the tears? Fantastic. This turned out better than I expected. Perhaps a little bit of a bonus is in order. <laughs> oh, well. You know how to make me happy. They're the pride of my collection. Cool. The tears look beautiful in my collection. A thousand thanks once again. Greetings, journeyman. All right, we're going to... better. All right, so we're going to call it there. I hope you all have enjoyed this one. I know I did. That uh, painting quest is one of the more amusing ones in the game, I think. We'll be back next week with some more. Um, kind of hit most of the miscellaneous quests in the game now, at least from the cities. I guess there's some more in here. There's some more in uh, Shaden Hall. But maybe we'll do something else. Maybe we'll check out some more Oblivion Overhaul stuff next time. I'm not quite sure yet. We'll see. But uh, until then, I want to thank you very much for watching, as always. And I'll see you on the next one. Ooh.